Imagine waking up one day to find a volcano emerging in your cornfield. Sounds incredible? Well, not for Dionisio Pulido, a Mexican farmer. On an ordinary day in the early part of 1943, Dionisio Pulido was working in his cornfield, but this day was about to become anything but ordinary. It was February 20th, and the ground beneath Pulido's feet began to rumble. A fissure opened up in the earth, and with a thunderous roar, rocks and ash erupted into the sky. This was no ordinary earthquake or minor eruption. This was the birth of a new volcano, and not just any volcano, but Paracutan, one of the few volcanoes in the world whose emergence has been witnessed by human eyes. Pulido and the other villagers watched in astonishment as the crack in the earth grew wider and deeper. Plumes of smoke billowed into the sky and a pile of volcanic ash began to accumulate. It wasn't long before the growing mound became a hill and then a mountain. In the space of a single day, Pulido's cornfield had transformed into a volcanic landscape. The villagers understandably were filled with a mix of awe and fear. They had no idea what was happening or what to do. Many fled their homes, fearing that the eruption would destroy their village. Others stayed, captivated by the spectacle unfolding before their eyes. But amidst the chaos, Pulido remained calm. He understood that what was happening was a natural phenomenon, albeit a rare one. He knew that there was no stopping the forces of nature, so he did what he could to protect his family and his home. He evacuated his family and moved them to a safer location. The birth of Paracutan was a sight to behold. It was a reminder of the raw and untamed power of Mother Nature. It was a testament to the resilience and adaptability of the human spirit. And above all, it was a demonstration of the astonishing beauty that can emerge from the most unexpected places. This was the beginning of an unprecedented geological event that caught the world's attention. Within a year, the Paracutan volcano grew from a fissure in the earth to a towering 1,102 feet. This was no ordinary volcanic eruption, but a rapid, almost explosive growth that seemed to defy the laws of nature. The Paracutan volcano was not content to simply exist. It wanted to dominate, and it did so with a fiery passion that was awe-inspiring and terrifying in equal measure. This was a force of nature in its purest form, raw and uncontrolled. In its wake, it left a trail of destruction that was as impressive as it was devastating. As the volcano grew, so too did its influence on the surrounding landscape. The nearby villages of Paracutan and San Juan Parangaricutiro found themselves in the path of this unstoppable force. The once tranquil and idyllic villages were soon buried under a thick layer of ash and lava. The inhabitants, their lives uprooted by this sudden catastrophe, were forced to flee their homes and seek refuge elsewhere. Imagine the sight of this towering volcano, its peak shrouded in a thick cloud of smoke as it loomed over the landscape. The once vibrant fields of green were now a desolate wasteland, littered with the remnants of what once was. It was a stark reminder of the power and unpredictability of nature. Yet, amidst the destruction, there was a sense of wonder and fascination. Here was a volcano that had quite literally sprung up overnight, its growth a spectacle that had never been witnessed before. Scientists from around the world flocked to Paracutan, eager to study this unique phenomenon. Their findings would go on to contribute significantly to our understanding of volcanology. The rapid growth of the Paracutan volcano was indeed a spectacle, a display of nature's power and grandeur. But it also brought devastation, leaving in its wake a landscape forever changed and a people displaced. It served as a poignant reminder of the delicate balance that exists between the beauty of nature and its potential for destruction. The rapid growth of the Paracutan volcano was a spectacle, but it also brought devastation. The Paracutan volcano was not just a spectacle of nature, but also a unique opportunity for scientists. This fiery titan that erupted from a humble cornfield in Mexico allowed researchers to observe and study a volcanic life cycle from birth to extinction in real time, a rarity in geological studies. During the volcano's nine years of activity, from 1943 to 1952, scientists flocked to Paracutan, turning it into a bustling hub of geological research. They came from all corners of the globe, their eyes bright with curiosity, and their minds brimming with questions. What they found was a treasure trove of information about volcanic activity and the geological phenomenon known as Strombolian eruptions. Strombolian eruptions, named after the Stromboli volcano in Italy, are characterized by explosive bursts of lava that can reach impressive heights. These eruptions are caused by the buildup and release of gas bubbles in the molten rock or magma within the volcano. 
Paracutin's eruptions were primarily of the Strombolian type, providing an unparalleled chance to study this phenomenon up close. Scientists observed the volcano's eruptions, meticulously recording details about the frequency, duration and magnitude of the explosive events. They collected samples of the ejected material, analyzing the composition of the lava and volcanic ash. These studies gave them valuable insight into the internal workings of a volcano and the magma's journey from deep within the earth to the surface. One of the most significant findings from the studies conducted at Paracutan was the role of water in volcanic eruptions. Researchers discovered that water from the surrounding environment, when heated by the magma, could turn into steam and contribute to the explosive force of the eruption. This finding has since shaped our understanding of volcanic hazards and the importance of volcano monitoring. The Paracutan volcano served as a live laboratory for geologists around the world. It offered a window into the heart of a volcano, revealing the destructive yet fascinating power of our Earth's interior. The lessons learned from Paracutan continue to inform volcanic studies today, a testament to its enduring impact on the scientific community. After nine years of consistent eruptions, the Paracutan volcano suddenly fell silent in 1952. This cessation of activity was as unexpected as its violent birth. The once fiery spectacle that painted the skies with shades of red and orange was now replaced with an eerie calm. The smoke cleared, the tremors subsided, and the once formidable Paracutan fell into a deep undisturbed sleep. This abrupt end to the eruptions left scientists puzzled. Theories abounded, attempting to explain this sudden silence. Some suggested that the magma supply had been exhausted, while others believed that the pressure had been sufficiently relieved to halt the volcanic activity. Nevertheless, the exact reason remains a mystery, a riddle tucked away in the heart of the earth. In the aftermath of the eruptions, the landscape was forever changed. Lush green fields and bustling villages were replaced with a barren, lunar-like surface. The once fertile lands were now blanketed with a thick layer of volcanic ash and rock. The villages of San Juan Parangaricutiro and Paracutan were entirely swallowed by the lava flow, leaving only the tops of the church's towers as a haunting reminder of what once was. Despite the destruction, life found a way to adapt. Over time, plants began to sprout from the volcanic soil, their roots breaking through the hardened lava. Animals returned to the area, drawn by the new vegetation. The local communities, although displaced, carried on with their lives, their resilience a testament to the indomitable human spirit. Today, the Paracutan volcano is a dormant giant. It stands tall against the sky, its once fiery heart now silent and cold. Its slopes, once a canvas of molten rock and ash, now host a variety of flora and fauna. The volcano and the surrounding areas have transformed into a unique ecosystem, a blend of destruction and rebirth. Although silent, Paracutan is not forgotten. It continues to be a subject of intense study, providing invaluable insights into the life cycle of cinder cone volcanoes. Its sudden birth and cessation have made it a unique case in the annals of geology. Today the Paracutan volcano stands dormant, a silent testament to the power of nature. Though dormant, the Paracutan volcano continues to draw attention, not for its eruptions but for its beauty and history. Today, the Paracutan volcano, nestled in the heart of Mexico, stands as a testament to nature's awe-inspiring power and resilience. It's a place where the past and the present merge, painting a vivid picture of life's enduring cycle. The once fiery landscape is now a serene and stunning panorama of volcanic remnants, lush vegetation, and crystal clear skies. The volcano's unique formation and history have turned it into a major tourist attraction, drawing in thousands of visitors each year. Its majestic silhouette against the backdrop of azure skies is a spectacle that leaves many breathless, and the panoramic views from its summit are truly a sight to behold. From there, one can see the sweeping landscapes of Mikoakan, a tapestry of verdant fields, quaint villages, and distant mountain ranges. But the Paracutan experience isn't just about sightseeing. The area is ripe with opportunities for outdoor activities. Hiking up the volcano is a popular choice, offering a thrilling adventure and the reward of breathtaking views. Horseback riding through the lava fields provides a unique way to explore the terrain, while birdwatching draws in nature enthusiasts, eager to spot endemic species in their natural habitat. The local communities have also embraced the volcano's tourism potential. They offer guided tours sharing the volcano's history and their personal narratives, thereby adding a deep cultural significance to the visit. 
authentic local cuisine, traditional crafts, and warm hospitality further enrich the tourist experience. It's fascinating how the Paracutan volcano has transformed over the decades. From a destructive force that reshaped the landscape and displaced communities, it has evolved into a symbol of resilience and a source of livelihood. The Paracutan volcano is more than just a geological wonder. It's a place that tells a story, a story of nature's might, of human resilience, and of life's extraordinary ability to reclaim and thrive. It serves as a reminder that even in the face of adversity, beauty and life can emerge. The Paracutan volcano, once a symbol of destruction, is now a beacon of natural beauty and resilience. The Paracutan volcano has not only captivated scientists and tourists, but also artists and writers. This sleeping giant, nestled in the heart of Mexico, has left an indelible mark on popular culture, extending its influence beyond the scientific and natural world into the realms of art, literature, and media. Let's delve into the artistic world first. The unique landscape of Paracutan, with its stark volcanic cone against the lush greenery, has been a muse for many painters. The most notable among them is perhaps Dr. ATL, a celebrated Mexican painter and writer. He was so fascinated by the Paracutan volcano that he devoted an entire series of paintings to it, encapsulating the raw power and beauty of this natural wonder in his signature style. Next, we turn the pages to literature. The sudden birth and rapid growth of Paracutan have provided a rich narrative for authors. The volcano became a symbol of transformation and unpredictability, themes that resonated with readers worldwide. John Steinbeck, in his book The Pearl, used Paracutan as a metaphor to represent the sudden change in the protagonist's life, underscoring the volcano's influence in literary circles. In the media, Paracutan has had its fair share of the limelight. It was the backdrop for several films and documentaries, with its dramatic scenery providing a captivating visual narrative. It has also been featured in numerous travel and nature programs, showcasing its allure to a global audience. Moreover, Paracutan holds a unique place in the world of philately. In 2005, the Mexican Postal Service issued a stamp featuring the volcano, commemorating its birth and the 75th anniversary of its first eruption. This stamp is a testament to the volcano's cultural significance and its enduring appeal. The Paracutan volcano, a natural wonder, continues to inspire and intrigue. Its presence in popular culture is a testament to its powerful allure, influencing artists, writers, filmmakers, and even stamp collectors. It serves as a reminder of how nature's grandeur can transcend boundaries and captivate hearts and minds across the globe. The Paracutan volcano, a unique geological phenomenon, is a testament to the fascinating and unpredictable nature of our planet. As we come to the end of our journey through the life of the Paracutan volcano, it's important to reflect on what we've discovered. Born out of an ordinary cornfield in the span of a single day, this volcano's birth was nothing short of extraordinary. Its rapid growth, culminating in a towering height of over 1,200 meters, is a stark reminder of the sheer power and unpredictability of nature. The destruction it unleashed on the surrounding landscape was devastating, yet it provided an invaluable opportunity for scientists to study a volcano's life cycle from birth to extinction. The wealth of knowledge gained from these studies has greatly contributed to our understanding of volcanology, and the Paracutan volcano continues to be a significant point of reference in the scientific community. But this volcano isn't just a subject of scientific interest, it has also become a symbol of resilience for the people of Mikoakan, who rebuilt their lives in the aftermath of its eruption. The hauntingly beautiful lava fields and the church half buried in volcanic ash serve as poignant reminders of this chapter in their history. Today, the Paracutan volcano stands silent and majestic, its once fiery slopes now covered with lush vegetation. It's a testament to how life can flourish even in the harshest of conditions. This volcano has transformed from a force of destruction to a beacon of hope and rebirth, attracting visitors from around the world who are captivated by its beauty and serenity. The Paracutan volcano has also made its mark in popular culture, inspiring countless works of art, literature, and music. Its story resonates with people far and wide, reminding us of the awe-inspiring power of nature and our place within it. In conclusion, the Paracutan volcano is much more than just a geological landmark. It's a symbol of life's resilience in the face of adversity, a source of invaluable scientific knowledge, and a place of breathtaking natural beauty. It's a testament to the ever-changing and awe-inspiring nature of our planet. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the life of the Paracutan volcano. 
We hope you found it as captivating and enlightening as we have. There are countless more fascinating stories from our beautiful planet waiting to be explored, and we look forward to sharing them with you. So, if you've enjoyed this journey through the life of the Paracutan volcano, don't forget to leave a comment like, share this video, and subscribe for more fascinating stories from our beautiful planet. Whether you're a seasoned traveler, a budding geologist, or simply a lover of nature's wonders, we invite you to join us as we continue to explore the marvels of our world. Until next time, keep exploring, keep learning, and keep marveling at the beauty that surrounds us.